This is wind turbine 78. It keeps shutting down. Looks like the blades are re-engaging. Let's see how long it stays online this time. Last time it only ran a minute and 20 seconds. The blades are re-engaging. Over here by the freeway. Okay, here it goes. Blades are engaged. Starting to make noise. Let's see how long it lasts. Lots of oil leaking around the hub on this one, around the blades. One minute. This turbine is very close to the freeway. If it throws a blade towards the freeway, it's capable of hitting the freeway. I can see the generator starting to yaw a little bit. There's two minutes. You can see the generator has yawed a little bit. Oh, it's shutting down. After, looks like it's gonna be about three minutes. Yep, that's it. I don't know if something's getting hot or what, but you can tell that the generator has rotated. Blades are feathered and she's shutting down. Siemens 2.3 dash 108 turbines with as you can see the generator is continuing to yaw back and forth this is an area where we've seen a lot of gearbox replacements and a lot of these turbines in this area and as you can see, it's very close to the freeway. As I was saying, a blade throw could land on the freeway. But in this area, there's mountains all around here that 
could disrupt the wind direction. So I believe the wind does come from many different directions in this area, which plays havoc on these things. The generator continues to yaw. It's pretty much 90 degrees to me now as the red lights come on on the facility. Just another problem with these Siemens 2.3-108 turbines.